I think we have to have a broader conversation about whether we value women and whether we want to make sure women have every opportunity in the workplace. And I want to address uh, Vice President Biden directly. Um, when the Senate was debating uh, middle class affordability for child care, he wrote an op-ed. He voted against it, the only vote. But what he, he wrote an op-ed was that he believed that uh, women working outside the home would, quote, create the deterioration of family. Um, he also said that women who were working outside the home were, quote, avoiding responsibility. And I just need to understand, as a woman who's worked my entire career as the primary wage earner, as the primary caregiver, in fact, the second, my second son, Henry, is here. And I had him uh, when I was a member of Congress. So under Vice President Biden's analysis, am I serving in Congress, resulting in the deterioration of the family because I had access to quality, affordable daycare? I just want to know what he meant when he said that. That was a long time ago, and here's what it was about. It would have given people making today $100,000 a year a tax break for child care. I did not want that. I wanted the child care to go to people making less than $100,000, and that's what it was about. As a single father, who in fact raised three children for five years by myself, I have some idea what it cost. I support making sure that every single solitary person needing child care get an $8,000 tax credit now. That would put 700 thousand women back to work, increase the GDP by almost eight-tenths of one percent. It's the right thing to do. If we can give tax breaks Thanks. to corporations for these things, why can't we do it this way? But, Mr. Thank Vice you. President, you didn't answer my question. What did you mean when you said when a woman works outside the home, it's resulting in, quote, the deterioration of family? No, what and I that we are avoiding... These are quotes. It was the title of the op-ed. No. And that just causes concern for me because we know America's women are working. Four out of 10 moms have to work. They are the primary or sole wage earners. They actually have to put food on the table. Eight out of 10 moms are working today. Most women have to work to provide for their kids. Many women want to be working to provide for their communities you, and Senator. to help people. Let so the Vice President either you don't up. believe Thank it you. today or what did you mean when you said it In then? In the very beginning, my deceased wife worked, but we had children. My present wife has worked all the way through raising our children. The fact of the matter is, the situation is one that I don't know what's happened. I wrote the Violence Against Women Act, Lily Ledbetter. I was deeply involved in making sure there are the equal pay amendments. I was deeply involved in all these things. I came up with the It's On Us proposal to see to it that women were treated more decently on college campuses. You came to Syracuse University with me and said it was wonderful. I'm passionate about the concern making sure women are treated equally. I don't know what's happened except that you're now running for president. 